kepentingan lawatan yang berhormat Tuan Bobby CEO Menteri Komunikasi dan Multimedia Malaysia pada hari ini. Um, Finance Minister Lim Kuan Yew has said that political party ownership of the media should be controlled or abolished. Um, any plans to review that? Well, that's something that we are considering. There are two or three different views that have been put forward. Uh, some of them speak about uh, controlling companies that control certain newspapers and so forth. Some of them speak about controlling licenses. Uh, some of them talks about uh, some of the views talk about how it is uh, you can allow uh, shareholding but not in a way that allows them to control uh, the, the news agency and so forth. Uh, I think what is important is for us to sit down and understand what it is we want to achieve from this. Uh, if we want to ensure that political parties do not control newspapers or news portals, then I think we should look at it from that angle. And of course how that is to be achieved uh, is something that uh, we have to work on. I have earlier taken a position that political parties should not yeah, should not control any of the media portals or the newspapers. My position remains, uh, and I think uh, at the end of the day, uh, this is something that the cabinet will have to decide. But I want to make it very, very clear now that we have not posed this question in the cabinet yet because we are doing studies on it, and uh, of course there are various options that are going to be brought forward. So let us look at the options first. And once we look at the options, then I'll be able to state uh, what uh, and tell you uh, what it is the cabinet has considered, explain to you why there are different suggestions, what the strengths and weaknesses of all the other suggestions are, and uh, what do you call, I think we can have that discussion after the cabinet has made a decision on that. Thank you. Thank you.